Hi, I'm Dokas and I'm a student of Chinua University attending my classes virtually from Italy. Today, I'll be taking you through my day as a student of Chinua University virtually and I'll be sharing how I'm able to manage my schedules and work with the time difference because as you know, China and Italy has a huge time difference, which is around, I think it's around six hours permanently. So my schedule is quite different from other students. And so I try to manage my working hours and my sleeping hours so that I can balance everything up as much as I can. And I also try to involve in some activities, which I'm going to be sharing with you to have a little experience, if not so much experience of being a Chinua University student, even while at home. And so I just finished my lecture for to, for this morning. That's my first lecture today. And I still have some other ones. But then because time difference is really wide and I have to wake up pretty early as I've shown you. So right now what I do is I take more like a nap in the morning just to get enough hours of sleep because it's very important for me to be able to assimilate and actually follow through with the other lectures of today. It's a bright day already and first of all I start my day with stretching my legs and before I continue my class because I have to sit down for a long time just at a point so it's just a way of allowing blood to flow through my body and I go ahead with my other activities which is just going to be me having a presentation which is for a short time and it was fun and it's just a way of actually improving my speaking skills and just learning generally of the environment we should know that glyphosate as a substance is not as so much toxic compared to when it's in it by the time I'm done with my class it's lunch time already so I go ahead to have lunch. Usually I just have lunch that reminds me of home, which is my country, Nigeria. And of course we eat with our hands. I've heard so much about the canteens in Chinua University and I look forward to experiencing it. For the afternoons, I usually have meetings with my colleagues. And for this, I usually go out of my room to experience something different from the first square of my room. And this time around, I go to a garden where I can experience the nature, the good weather, and just something different. Then after the meeting, I go ahead to just take a little bit of my time to rest from the busy day before I go ahead with the other activities. <laughs> One of the things that I love to do lately is taking a walk and seeing the city, the same city. And for me, it's a relaxing thing and I need to relax after a busy day. And follow me and I hope you enjoy this. Food is a very important thing in every life and I'm going to say especially for students and this is why it is a very important part of my day. Usually I go ahead to restock my groceries and then to just make sure that I have everything ready for me to eat and cook and usually I go ahead to pick up my groceries and other things that I need to buy from shops that I'm familiar with which is the African store that sells things that reminds me of home And finally, I'm hanging my day with a, a run, and this is what I just do to keep, keep myself active and, and just balance up the day. And now I'm done with the running. And this is how I end my day. 
because I wake up early and for, to attend my classes, I have to go to bed early. So right now, I'm just going to go have my dinner and sleep early. And this is just the way I manage myself while studying from Italy and attend my classes online with Chinua. So far, it's been interesting and wonderful. And I'm hoping to join them too. But before I join, I still just want to experience all that I can experience while being a student online. Thank you very much for watching and I hope you enjoyed this. And do join Chinua to experience this wonderful feelings.